I get that slogan from get that slogan from uh bankroll fresh uh you know street money worldwide uh back in georgia you know i am from georgia so you know i like to keep up with the lingos and whatnot but you know it's it's time man r.i.p that's the plan that's the plan of money now they trying to get rest of truth now they trying to get fast of truth now they trying to get fast of truth so much of the money i mess with run through the money i mess with I just stop playing with them. I just stop playing with them. I want some more on the bank. I want some more of the rich. I got no time for the bitch. I want some more for my niggas. I want some more for my niggas. Yeah, yeah. I just stop playing with them. I just stop playing with them. I want some more on the bank. Man, they don't even know the half. Put in a lot of work for this, man. It's hot out here too, but you know we gonna make it work. Uh, that was the first. Uh, look that we're doing. We got a few more looks, and man, we're gonna get to it. Follow your boy, you know. guys for four years now man they really you know groom me and brought me into the business man they keep me level-headed and straight make sure I don't you know do anything out of the ordinary never really want to put myself you know in a bad situation so I definitely always make sure you know I talk to Willie Nathan like I said man four years in the making man I love these guys to death you know if it wasn't for them I don't know where I would be at in this business but you know I couldn't have a better better you know group of people to work with besides those two uh, this is the last look uh, we're about to go knock this out uh, really enjoy being on set today uh, you know knocking out this photo shoot it's another uh, thing I'm gonna add to my portfolio so yeah man check me out man follow me That was the last take. We are officially done. Uh, appreciate you guys, man. You know, taking a look at this video in advance. Definitely been going hard, hard as ever than I ever have been. Uh, man, we just trying to make it. You know, we gonna we gonna make this year a good year, man. I, I told myself 2016 was gonna be my year, and so far, you know, I definitely been you know booking jobs here and there and making things happen. Also, be on the lookout. We about to finish up the production of Between the Lines. It's coming soon. Uh, yeah, man, and that's a wrap, man. Appreciate you guys. Yeah, so we are in Austin now. Got to get that, the good stuff, you know, in my body, you know, before I go in here so I can kind of get a little amped up. about to go knock this out it's audition time it's always good to be ready you gotta stay ready so yeah we're about to go and knock this out on the way
thousand years later. Good friend said, man, it's you know good seeing him. It's been a while. It's been a minute. Yeah, it's, it's been a long time, time but you know he's in the business too as well. Uh, we used to work together at Monroe, so yep. you know tell these people said this is not easy, man. It's a, it takes a lot of work, it's, man. It's a lot of work, man. A lot of work. I mean, like we're coming from Dallas, all the way down here, all the way down here, three hours just for maybe like a five ten minute audition. Uh, less, like it literally that, that audition was literally like two minutes, you exactly. know. So and right back on the road. I mean, it's. A, to struggle yeah man you, you know gotta, but you gotta grind it's good to run into people man you know to you know highlight the same thing to let them know that you know it just ain't me you know it's other friends in the business you know i hit getting it in so man it was good man running already, here to you already, my brother man. man i wish you the best of luck man already too right hey we headed back to dallas all right y'all take care man <laughs> yep. in detail. They were popping collars, I was patient. That's a mess of foul, nigga, flagrant. Got on hella change like a slave bit. And the mad it never contemplated. Nigga gripping chain up the down street. I repeat Peter Bank Road, Fresh Street. We got a surprise for y'all. We're gonna take y'all to one of my favorite spots. I love going to this spot, no matter where I'm at. If they got one in the U.S., in any state, I'm going to it. Stay tuned. Yeah, I told y'all I was gonna take y'all to one of my favorite spots, man. This is by far one of my favorite spots, no matter where I go. So, hey, look up in the sky. It's a bird, it's a plane. No, it is a... Ross. Ross, baby. Ross. We are going in. So I'm finna go see what they got. they doing man while the rich getting richer and the poor getting poor man that's sad man because guess what man they they had to, everything to lose stuff that we did on you know people just trying to get back up on their feet they talking about help help what the hell at, man there ain't no real help man what they at though man they just took the little bit of stuff yeah. you know it's all about man come on man they didn't have to just do it like that man you know, man, they did people bad, man. Now, you got all these people now, where they going, man? Now they just out scattering around. They know what they're doing. It's all about the money, man. The rich getting rich and the poor getting poor, man. Man, I'm straight out of Dallas, Texas, man. Never been straight out to Dallas, Texas, man. Never been out of Dallas. Never been, never been nowhere. I've been right here in Dallas, man. D-Town, baby. And guess what? When you're in the system, you're in the system, man. Message. Bless y'all, man. Man, y'all heard what he said, man. Straight out of Dallas, man. The rich are getting richer. The poor are getting power. Yeah, man. He ain't lying either. So I'm trying to get rich. I'm trying to get some of this mailbox money. Keep that coming. Really enjoy that mailbox money, man. I wish we could have really helped him, man. That's that's a sad situation to see, but I mean, man, you're gonna see that like that in any town. I mean, that's just the just the way life is sometimes, man. You never really know what people got going on in their life, man. You know uh, where they headed, or you know how they got there. But richer getting richer, poor getting poor. Isn't that a shame? <laughs>